Mm. What up, cut ups? Hope y'all feeling good out there today. Me personally, I'm getting tired of the sun not being out, guys. It's it's so depressing, you know. This is like today is Tuesday and it's like the sun just hasn't been out, you know, even if it's cold outside. I just like the sun being out, you know. But anyway, other than that, um just a little bothered everybody. Um it's it's definitely something on my mind and Everybody knows when I have something to say. Y'all know I'm going to say it. So I'm going to be um, I'm going to be indirect like a lot of people uh, are when they address me uh, just to keep the drama down. But if you people know me and if y'all know my YouTube uh, channel or YouTube resume you know, drama's attached to it. So I'm going to try to say what I need to say with as less drama as I can. But according to the title of this video, nobody knows what God has in store for them. Nobody. It's nobody out here that knows that. We're all human beings. We all make mistakes. There's no perfect person out here, okay? No matter how God-like some people may think they are or, you know, whatever. You're not God. You don't know what God's plans are for the next individual. And you guys, I just think it's so sad, you know, so many people have so much to do out here in this big world, but for some reason, they're just, it just don't seem like people are really living a life 100% until something about me is said, whether it's indirectly or directly. Even though I'm going to be honest, I do have more respect for the people that come outright and say the things that they have to say about me. You know, be outright with it. You know, you don't have to throw indirect shape because whether you know it or not people know who you're talking about okay they know what you're talking about so i just want to say that you don't know you know what is going to happen in my life um, i know you would like to assume you do but can i just do me in my life because Man, I'm, I'm trying to get my piece of the pie, and I really just don't understand why certain people out here don't even want me to get a dollar. Like, they don't want me making a dollar, you know? And they got it all. Like, I'm really confused. What's wrong with everybody getting a piece of the pie? Or maybe, let me, let me define it a little bit more. I guess it's just me that they're so bothered about. I'm so, so confused as to why you cannot carry on in your life. Little life. And I'm going to say little life because compared to God, that's what it is. Everybody's life is little. I don't care how big you think you are. Okay. Or how small. It's a little life compared to God. Okay. And you don't know what he has in store for any person. So to sit on your platform and to say out of your mouth what's going to work for someone, what God will allow, what God won't allow, I think is very ignorant. It further shows that you're not as educated as you want people to think you are. You can, can't even really talk. But at the end of the day, why don't you focus more on that? You know, leave me alone. Okay, I know how to be indirect like you if I want to. But at the end of the day, I'm going to say this. As bad as you want me to just shrivel up, not be sexy anymore, not be my lively personality and my lively self. I know you don't want me on YouTube. You probably don't even want me breathing, really. You know, and... I just think that's sick, but I'm here to say, I ain't going nowhere. 
I'm gonna be right here. Okay. So I, I thought, you know, by now, y'all was used to seeing this face because it ain't going nowhere. YouTube can change all the guidelines they want to change. They can rearrange everyone's um, revenue, even though that social blade, I do have to say this, that social blade uh, income thing for YouTubers is off. I think it needs to be updated because I, I made way more than what, that, what they had up there. But anyway, I'm just going to say, why come I can't get my little piece of the pie? Why? And you know, when I did my sponsored video, someone did come and comment and say, you know, this is the one thing you probably shouldn't tell people. This is what your haters hate to hear, that you're doing well, that you're getting sponsorship. This is what bothers them. And I can't think of who left that comment right now, but yeah, you're right. But it's too bad. Because when they get something or they're doing something big, they want the whole world to know about it. So why can't I get my little shine? Why? So this is not going to be a video like the ones have been in my past because I now know how to address it this way. And I feel it's a more appropriate way than me just outright snapping and y'all know how I can be. So I think this video is a lot more conservative, okay? <laughs> but all I'm trying to say is, girl, please, like, Do you? Okay. Um, I wish you the best. Why can't you wish me the best? Why can't I get a dollar too? Why can't we all get, get a dollar? Why can't we all get, get a little change? What's wrong with that? Or it's just me? And if it's just me, all I can say is that it's just too bad. Because I ain't going nowhere. I'm going to be right here all up in your face. Okay? With my outfits of the day and doing me. Okay, as bad as you want me to just not live life anymore, to just, that's not, that's not going to happen. I'm going to be all right in my life, okay? And I just need to let people be aware of that. I've been here all this time. Okay, doesn't that tell you something? I've been uploading my videos you know, like I do, I'm still here. I'm not going anywhere. So just please, you know, to me, it's, it's that video that was made yesterday, I feel like was, it was so obvious, you know, um, even though my name was not said, I had people calling me and they were like, did you watch this video? Did you watch that video? I had people coming onto my channel, onto my video yesterday, okay? Asking me, did you see this at this time? Did you see this today? I did because someone sent it to me. I had a conversation about it, okay? And then after I saw it, yes, I came direct, like you know I will do. If I have to get my point known by coming to your house, to your channel, to where you are, period. Guess what? I'll be right there. And the only thing you're gonna do is retreat. And I already know this. And so do you. So, leave me alone. Let me do me. Please stop throwing the indirect shade because you know I can be direct 100% if I wanted to, like I was last week with my video. Okay? Or I can do it like you. Throw stones and hide my hands. Okay? Just to try to seem like you're not being messy. Honey, you are just as messy as anyone else out here. And I think even messier to think that you know so much about God and can predict what God is going to do for the next person. You don't know that. You should be concerned about keeping your blessings you should be concerned about God keeping you where he keeps you in your life, okay? And not worried about little old me, okay? Let me do me. I'm not bothering nobody, am I? But then again, that's questionable. 
because this, th these little videos with all this indirect shade and just any other and then people want to come to me and come to my channel and say I'm being messy baby I am doing what is being done to me, what has been done to me for the longest time. It's just that some people out there actually starting to wake up to this, okay? Like I said, I was told about this yesterday, and then that's why I, I made my video the way I made it yesterday with that little skit, because I am the somebody that was talked about or portrayed in that video. The hello somebody, that's me all day that's why i said it back so please don't say that i'm being messy do your research and understand what the fuck you're talking about first because it's been done to me and it's even being done um using other channels so at the end of the day please know what you're saying before you come to my channel talking crazy and, and i'm gonna be honest i have not had a lot of that because like i said people are starting to see Okay, what I've known. And I know that people attacked me when I came speaking my truths. People came and attacked me. I didn't care because I will go up against them one by one if I have to. Again. But at the end of the day, I choose not to let it get that messy. Okay, like I said, I'm going to stay making the type of videos that you understand. In direct shade. Even though y'all know I'm a very direct person and can say my shit directly. Okay? So, keep me out your mouth, whether it's direct or indirectly, and then I won't have anything to say. Okay? But if you keep doing this, you'll see me popping up as well as the people around you or in your camp will see me popping up saying my truths. Okay, whether you like it or not. So it's best to just leave me alone. That way I'll stay over here on my channel. And okay. But if you come to this channel, you're going to get what's real. That's it. That's all. Okay. If you can't stand the truth, don't come. Okay. If you don't know what you're talking about and you're just speculating, but you really don't know. Don't come here with that shit. You should know what's going to happen. If you don't, let me tell you, you will get cussed out and blocked off this channel, okay? So know what you are saying. But like I said, I didn't even have a lot of people um, really that came to me in, in that way that was bad. You know, yesterday on, on a couple of my videos, like, you know, it's just not happening like that. And... I just want to end this video now because I'm pretty much done. I pretty much said what I had to say, but I just want to end it by saying, no, you don't know what God has in store for me or for anyone else. You're not God. Okay. You are a little person. Okay. No matter how big you think you are, you're, are, you are, you're a little person compared in God's eyes. We're all okay the same in God's eyes. Nobody is more special than anybody else. So, like I said, I think it was very ignorant, okay, whether you said it indirectly or not, to even think you can comment on what God is going to do for someone else. You do not know that. So, at the end of the day, the only thing I can really say is if you feel some type of way, and if you feel that I'm just God's throwaway, that nothing can ever happen for me good in my life, okay, that I'm not going to get anywhere, the only thing I can say is keep watching. Thank you.